What's up, everybody? Jason here from jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2021 Panini Elite Football six box half case break figure teams number five just sold out. This is an all card ship break, 20 packs per box, five cards per pack. And again, two autographs, one more the card, three rookies, six parallels, 11 inserts. And again, pick your team style. There you go. So last spot mojo was PJ getting the Jaguars, guys. Jaguars. Fresh case here, guys. Uh, again, six box half case break. So the other half, of course, would be used for the next break. And we'll just do the top six here and bottom six as one break. Six left, six right. One, two, three, four, five, six. One. So one, two, three. So these right here will be for pick your teams number six. Let's get your Trevor Lawrence, PJ. Did you get into some of this stuff yesterday, PJ? How's it looking, guys? I, I didn't really see yesterday, actually. I was, was a little out and about yesterday. Um, Chad, by my knowledge, I mean, unless, unless we were doing... Um, Unless we were doing two more of the other ones. I mean, you know what? Maybe you're right. Let me take off the pack then. But um, unless we were doing uh, two of the other ones, then we still have to do two more. So then maybe I have to do two blasters then. Because I was off by one spot there, so maybe I'm thinking we have to do two blasters then. So if that's the case, then we still have to do two blasters and no more cello packs. You get me? So I'll take that off right now, just to be safe. But if that's the case, then we have to do two more blasters. That actually would make sense why we're off by one. Because we still have... Yeah, you know what? I think you're right. So you know what? We have to do two blasters instead of uh, one and one. That makes sense. So... Right now, before I do the last prison pack that already sold out, we have a total of 14 spots remaining, right? So when we do that prism, uh, uh, do that prism cello pack, that'll take off four spots. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, I wasn't gonna oversell, but what was gonna happen, Chad, is I thought it was two and two. And what was gonna happen was we were gonna have one full spot left over. But now that makes sense. Maybe Nick intended it to be you know, three blasters and one cello pack or two cello packs and and three blasters instead of three and three. If you get if you get what I mean. Because when I was looking at when I was looking at the spots left, we were gonna be off by one, so I would have to sell one full spot. But now that makes sense. Maybe maybe Nick intended to just do one more prism cello pack and then do two more blasters. Cause like I said, we're missing fourteen spots. When we do the cello pack that brings it down to ten. We do the next optic blaster that brings it down to five, and then we just gotta sell one more. So yeah, I think that's what I'll do. So I took off actually the pack break. Thank you though, Chad. So that would just mean that we have to do two blaster boxes basically.
And I'll update it in the schedule as well. Oh, did he? Yeah. You're definitely good with math. So yeah, that makes more sense. Yeah, because it would suck if we had to do another cello pack and then, you know, for some weird reason, I had to sell one spot and no one was buying into it. <laughs> and I'd have to just like, you know, put in another pack break. That'd be, that would have been rough. So yeah, then guys, we got to do two of those then, basically. And that would sell it out. All right, good luck, guys. Khalil Mack and whoa, a little pen pals right off the bat. Trey Lance, who has the 49ers? Rob Flores. Look at that. And actually, guys, shout out to Rob. Came into the store today. Pick this up from him. Thank you. Hopping the PC out. Little Brady insert. Brady base. You got Calvin Ridley, the 399. Oh, there you go. <laughs> These are really cool. To 75, Lamar Jackson. Patty Mahomes. And Back to the Future, Ryan. What is that number two? 149. Ramzyk. Whoa, this looks cool as hell. Scary Terry McLaurin. <laughs> Terrence Marshall Jr. To 49, Deami Brown. That's for the Washington football team. Javon Holland. I was at that Roswell game. That game was great. Herbert had like three rushing touchdowns. No passing touchdowns, though, but like three rushing. Oh, it's a nice looking card. Star status Aaron Rodgers to 349. Rookie Elitis. Oh, Trey Lance. To 99, Justin Fields. Devonta Smith for my Eagles to five ninety nine. Kadarius Tony, that's a cool one. Elite Company. So I might have to randomize this uh, between the teams since they are multiple teams. Uh, but if there's like, oh, well, I guess I'm gonna have to randomize them actually. Let's just do that. But I think if I look on, well, actually, how about this? If I go look on the checklist and it just shows Jamar Chase only, then I will leave it to Jamar Chase. But if not, then of course I'm going to randomize that. But I, I think I will have to anyways. Was Sean randomizing those yesterday, guys? If you, if you remember? I'm assuming he was. Yes, Cerritos. Shane Bichelli. A two, a die cut to 24. Like a really cool die cut. I hate these die cuts for that reason. There we go. Braden Cooks. I am not from Philly. I'm one of those. Uh, Um, I be, uh, I'm one of those uh, fans that, of course, grew up with no football team here, living in L.A. Grew 
growing up in LA in the 90s, early 2000s. So, um, I ventured out, of course. But I've been to Philly. Went to my first Eagles game a few years ago. But anytime the Eagles come to LA, I've always seen them. LA, to Oakland, to Santa Clara. I've always showed my Eagles support on the West Coast, that's for sure. Went to a, like a game or two in Dallas. Yeah, two games in Dallas. That was fun. He was, I believe, but then seeing them go to the main player as well. Okay, cool. Well then, let's figure that out then. I'm going to go by the checklist, put it that way. Because usually when um, there is a card like this on the checklist, it'll show like all the teams. But if it doesn't, then I'm just going to give this to Jamar Chase. I mean, it really is only a Jamar Chase card, but it just gets a little confusing when it's like this. But I'll, do, I'll go by the checklist. That's usually what we do. So I don't think people will be arguing about that, but... I don't have a Sanders jersey. I do have two, like, player shirts, and I have a long sleeve. I do have a Wentz jersey, but unfortunately, you know, I probably won't be wearing that anymore. <laughs> the only ones I can still wear around and I, I feel confident in is because I just, they're legends. So I have a McNabb one. I have a Dawkins one. Um, but any, like, jersey, any, any one of my favorite players I've always got with my Eagles like, they were either, like, traded, cut, or, like, left the team within, like, two, three years. So, like, it started with, like, you know, when I was younger. I mean, I had a McNabb jersey before I had a Terrell Owens jersey. So, McNabb has always been safe. But when T.O. got, when T.O. signed or, you know, got traded to the Eagles, it was, I was just such the happiest little kid. Like, you should have seen me guys back in the day. I loved Terrell Owens and McNabb together, like, back in 04, 05 when they went to the Super Bowl. And if Terrell Owens doesn't break his leg, the Roy Williams horse collar tackle, I don't know, man. I feel like the Eagles could have beat the Patriots. And Tio was had over 100 yards, like 10 catches, whatever it was, with just like one leg. He had like a metal rod in his leg. I don't know. I always just go back to that. I feel like the Eagles could have easily won if healthier. Um, but then like, you know, a year or half a year later, of course, you know, he gets cut and like, you know, all the whole, um, you know, the outside workout press conference and yeah, I don't know. I wish it would have worked out better. I wish if like Tio or McNabb could have just worked it out better, they, you know, would have been much easier. And then I get like, you know, I get like a Deshaun Jackson jersey and that lasts me a couple of years, but then. You know, he gets cut. And then, you know, I get, like, a Shady McCoy. He gets, like... I don't know if he got cut, actually. He got traded, actually, for Kiko Alonso, right? Went, signs. That lasts me, like, two, three years. So I feel like all the jerseys I've ever gotten, really, didn't really last much longer. Dawkins, when he... Dawkins today still looks like he can play. Um, but he, when he retired, too, after the Broncos, he, I, he, I think he still could have played, but I just think he was just, like, mentally done with football already. Sammy. Turn of the century. That is a wide receiver there out of Stanford for the Cowboys. Rookie elitist. I was really sad though when, when the Eagles didn't re-sign Dawkins and he went to Denver. I, I, I don't think he should have ever left Philly. Quitty. Rebel says it does look like it'll have to be random. But okay, yeah. If it has to be randomized, cool. You know, I'm I'm not I'm not not for it. It's just I want to go by the checklist too. Jamar Chase, Bengals. AJ Brown and a redemption. Ah, oh, that makes sense. Yeah. But hey, 
You know, he came back with us. He retired an eagle, and you know, I think he's. I think he works for us still too in the organization. I mean, honestly, Rex, I think since we have to do a couple of fillers for each football and basketball mixer, I'm thinking that that probably won't go tonight. But the only other thing that I think we can go tonight is maybe the other half of this elite. That, that'd be kind of cool. Justin Fields. I feel like that won't be super hard to fill, especially if certain players or certain teams don't hit in this first half. Braden Cooks. Nice patch to 49. George Kittle. Yeah, I still can't. <laughs> I was just thinking about this right now again because it just blew my mind how this past week there's another Jamar Chase. Well, if for some weird reason, I like to do this, but if for some weird reason there's like multiples of these, and so far we would obviously Jamar Chase uh, be Bengals, right? If there was like three of these... I wouldn't mind just giving you guys each one, uh, especially if they all have to be randomized. That's kind of how I, I like to do it, just so everybody gets one. But that's only if there's like three, since there is two Browns players there, Jefferson. So, but we'll see at the end of the break. Uh, but yeah, going back, I can't believe that they, there's reports of Tom Brady playing with a torn MCL. Like, can you really believe that? <laughs> There was, like, so many doctors talking about it now, like, on the radio and online saying, like, there's no way that he played the whole season with a torn MCO. Yeah. Pen Pals. Card number 30. Nico Collins. Who did Nico get drafted by, guys? Houston Texans. Oh, wow, Misha Taiwan. All right, next box, guys.
Brady. Quincy Rose. Jamie Newman. We got Spellbound, Jerry Rice. Cowboys, see me, Ken Pels. Bateman, Ricky Elias. Jalen Waddle for the Dolphins. That is number to 125. Miami Dolphins going to David Duffy. Joe Burrow, number to 25. That looks really cool, like a little fireworks. And Adam Thielen, Craftsman, Relic. Minnesota Vikings, going to Jackson. Here's another one of those elite companies, so it'll be randomized as well. Number to 349. Joe Burrow was a razzle dazzle. Is that the name of the insert? It's a cool one. All right, guys. So we're halfway through.
Terrence Marshall Jr. Aziz Ojolari. Kadarius Tony for the Giants. And Stevenson. The Mondre. Patriots. Going to Karen Steele. Jalen Waddle. Darius Leonard. Josh Allen. Javon McKinley, uh, McKinley, sorry. Out of uh, 199. That's for the Lions. Patrick Davis. Little Mac Jones. Devonta Smith for my Eagles. Rogers. for the uh, Ravens. Murray Michael Parsons Justin Fields PJ, I'm, I'm just really wanting to get you something for the Jaguars. Of course, besides Trevor Lawrence, we can try to get you, of course, uh, his receiver, but still so far nothing, man. Last two boxes though. Got to play to the whistle. I know. I know. I, I got to play to the whistle too. Cause all it takes is that one box. Whew. Let's do it. Oh yeah, that's right. Clemson. That's what I was thinking. I, was, I don't know why I was thinking of. Uh, I don't know why I was thinking of Chase. That's Burrow. Rondell Moore. Cardinals wide receiver. 
Let me eat them. Two two out well. Oh, one of those elites. Spellbound pain, man. Terrence Marshall Jr. Larry Roundtree. Jalen Ramsey. Zeke. Zach Wilson. There we go. Rookie elitist, Trevor Lawrence. That's a nice little insert right there. It's a start, PJ. It's a start. Gotta get more Trevor. Big Ben Roethlisberger. Ooh, there we go. We're, we're heating up, PJ. We're heating up. To five ninety nine, Trevor Lawrence. Davis Mills. Turn of the century. That's for Houston. Brian Addison. Travis Etienne. Damn. We're starting. All right. We're, we're we're definitely starting to heat up. To three ninety nine. We're just not getting autographs right now, but maybe we're we're making way that way. Boston College. Hunter Long. Ian Book. And now. All right, last box mojo, guys.
Alright. Good luck, everybody. We got Jamar Chase. Number 299 inserts. Ozari. Or Ozari, sorry. Derek Carr to 49. Reynas, David Harrell. Kellen Mon. Dual threat, Jalen Hurts to 349. Did you go to Boston College, PJ, or did you just like BC? My brother loved Luke Keekley out of BC. I wish he didn't have so many concussions, man. This dude was such a great football player. Brevin Jordan. This is one of those elite companies. So what we're going to do with those elite companies, guys, is that we're just going to randomize uh, and we'll go, you know, we'll go like, um, you know, one, two, three, four, and then whatever it lands on, you know, that's where it'll go to. Oh, wow. That's awesome, man. That is so cool. T. Higgins, Elite. Back to the Future Signatures, number 275. That's so cool, man. So is it like... Is that was that always your number one choice, or like, or we, did you have to go there, or is it just because you know you wanted to like continue the tradition? Kyle Pitts, that's a nice pen pal. Tied in there for the Atlanta Falcons, going to Sean O'Leary. Kenny Sewell. To 99 full throttle. Patrick Jones. There you go, guys. So... Just only one big rookie quarterback on this side with that Trey Lance. That was really nice. Uh, but we still got some nice pen pals, though. But we still got a nice Trevor Lawrence insert. You know, a couple inserts there. Travis Etienne for the Jaguars. Uh, Kyle Pitts. The relics here. I got to top load these autographs. Rondell Moore. McKinley. Stevenson. Jalen Waddle was a nice autograph there. Um. Nico Collins Redemption. Of course, the Trey Lance was really nice. So, again, this was break number five, guys. Number six is in the store as well. Uh, so, like I said, I'm going to randomize this Elite. Well, let me double check the checklist first, but like, I think I'm going to do it because I feel like it should be randomized. Um, but what we're going to do, since they're all just, you know, the same style, we'll just go, like, we'll go from the back of the car. So, of course, if it goes to, like, this team up here, team one, two, three, and four. As we'll call it team one, two, three, and four. So if team two were to win the randomizer, then it's gonna automatically go to the first team here on the on the right side. So like that. That's how we'll call it. That way it just gets evenly distributed out like that way. And let me just pull up the checklist really quick.
Okay, yeah. So it does have it does have all the different players. So then we will be randomizing them like that. So then that's what we'll do. We'll go like you know player one, two, three, and four, and like I said, we'll do it from the back since the back is the way the sorter ship. So of course, player number one would be Jamar Chase. Player number two, Justin Jefferson. Player number three, Odell Beckham. Player number four, et cetera, et cetera. So since it does have all the players on there, that will be have to be randomized. So let's go player one, player two, player three, player four. Let's roll the dice, and it's a five and a six 11 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and it was five and a six, eleven. Boom. Player three. So again, as an example, like I said, this would be player one on the backside, player two, player three. So basically, Odell Beckham Jr. right there. Odell Beckham Jr. right there. This would be Ed Reed were to win that one. Michael Thomas, Jim McMahon, and then Jalen Smith. So there you go. Appreciate it, guys. Uh, so, again, this was Elite Number 5, jazbeescasebreaks.com.